Hello! This is Cinema 4D Quick Tips and today we will show you how to quickly paint on objects. Create a cylinder and make it editable by clicking on the Make Editable logo. Switch to the Paint Layout and click on the Paint Setup Wizard logo. The Select Objects window popped up. Make sure that the object or objects you want to paint on is selected and all other objects are deselected. Press the Next button. In the UV Setup window that appears, leave the Recalculate UV box and the Automatic Packed UVs radio button checked. If we don't do this, the painting on one part of the object will lead to the appearance of paintings on other parts of the object, since the current UV islands of the object overlap each other. Press the Next button. The Material Options window appeared. If the Create Missing Material box is checked, the Setup Wizard will create a new material for the selected object if it does not already have a material. This is what we need. We also leave the Create Delete Channel box checked, since we want to create a new texture. We want to paint on in the Color channel, so we leave checked only this channel, as suggested by default. To the right, you can choose another background color. Let's choose red color. The texture size can be calculated intelligently by the program within the given limits, but we can set specific values. Let's increase minimum width and height to 124 and leave the maximum at 124, the same as minimum. Finally, press the Finish button and close the Setup Wizard. If we go to the Texture UV Editor tab, we will see that the UV islands of the object are arranged properly. Let's switch back to the View tab. Now, using various tools on the right and left side of the paint layout, you can do many graphic editing operations. The interface here is similar to Photoshop. Let's click on the Brush tool, choose blue color, Increase the size of the brush and draw something on the cylinder. To add text, click on Draw Text tool, change the text to Cinema 4D, increase the font size and place the text on the cylinder. But if you make the text too big, it will become distorted and cut off. A more accurate result can be achieved in the Texture UV Editor. So, go to the Texture UV Editor tab and place the text here. Then, return to the View window and check the result. Thank you for your attention, subscribe to the channel and put your finger up.